Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are wondering what all of this is here, I promise I'm gonna come back to this at the end of the video when I share my thoughts on the new version of the Toiletry Pouch 26. So yes, we are talking about the Louis Vuitton Toiletry Pouch 26 yet again. This is the original version that had been discontinued last year. It was pulled from production and then they came out with a new version, which I talked about in great detail in my recent video. I'll link it up above if you missed it. It has black treated leather and and the construction, the materials are slightly different, as well as, of course, the price. And I talked about the pros and cons of that version compared to this one. So again, if you missed that video, you may want to go out, go back and check that out. But there seems to be another version, a new, new toiletry pouch 26 that has a chain. So I want to share with you all the details that I have on that new version that hasn't launched yet. It's supposed to launch this summer. I'm going to share that one. And I'm also going to share with you another version that not many people are talking about that is out already this month in April. So there are now multiple versions of this toiletry pouch 26, except for the original, which I really love. I adore this one. I think the simplicity of it is perfect. And yeah, so this is no longer available, but now there are multiple other styles available. So let's take a look. All right, here is the new, new toiletry pouch 26, and it comes in a set. It looks like the 26 size that we're all familiar with, and then the little one, which kind of looks like the 15 size, right? All three of those sizes, 15, 19, and 26, were discontinued, so it's kind of nice that they're coming out with a set here. You can see that there is a lot of vachetta on the sides. Well, I say a lot, but a lot more than the original version. And look, they added a little ring. Pause for reaction. I'm not trying to be, you know, critical, but that ring is not that sensational. And I'll talk about that in a minute. They also added a vachetta on the tab, the zipper pull, which I don't love, frankly, because with toiletry pouches, we're talking moisture, humidity, liquids. Yeah. So that vachetta is going to get marked up and stained. Now let's look at the inside. This is very similar to the other version that I shared in my previous video. It has card slots. It doesn't seem to have a wipeable interior anymore. It looks like a chestnut brown or a really chocolatey brown interior. And then on the smaller version, which I'm just going to call like the mini 15 size, no card slots, but yeah, also doesn't seem to have the wipeable interior. Also doesn't have the ring on the sides. So here, ta-da, they have basically taken six months to come up with this. They added a chain, as we, many of us, have been doing for a long time on our own with inserts and chains that we purchase separately, right? I haven't done that, but many people have been doing that, and I guess LV has been watching. <laughs> really? I mean... I just feel like it's not that sensational, not that innovative, nothing exciting. I put a poll on my Instagram and 82% of you said you're super annoyed by the new design and 18% of you said you were happy. So I am happy for those who are happy. Here are the details. It's going to be 1760 US dollars, I believe 1300 euros. Here is the item number and it's going to launch on June 17th. This is the other version that I was saying not many people are talking about. Credits to Foxy LV for posting. So this is the raffia version, also has the ring and the chain attached. It looks like there's black treated leather trim. I'm curious what you guys think of this version here. Um, raffia can be kind of itchy. I don't really know if I, yeah, I'm not really a fan of raffia material, but it does give off summer vibes. I feel like the black though is not very summery, you know, so it's a bit of a conflict there with the black and then the raffia. The inside does not seem to have any card slots all black. Here's the back. So yeah, multiple different versions coming out from Louis Vuitton now. And here's a close up of the front if you want the details. And here is the price, 1490 item numbers right there. And this has already launched as of April 28th. So if you're interested, and this is the version I was referring to earlier that I shared in my previous video. Go back and check that out if you want more details. But this has the black treated leather, so it's not going to be as high maintenance as the Vachetta. And it does have the card slots as well, but no ring and chain. <laughs> and this one is available for 1080. There's the, the Ida number and it is available now. You can place it in cart. I just checked this morning on the website. It is there. 
All right, so those are the three new versions of the toiletry pouch 26, and they all have different styles, different prices. I'm really curious what you guys think. I'm gonna play around with this a bit and share my own thoughts on what Louis Vuitton is doing, but first, I really would love your thoughts. Please share in the comments below. Would you go for the black version? I'm calling it black, but it has the black treated leather on the sides for 1080. Would you go for the Raffia version for $14.90? Or would you wait for the Toiletry 26 with chain that comes in a set with the little one too for $17.60? If you had to pick one, and I know we don't have to pick one, but just for fun, if you had to pick one, which one would it be? You know, there's pros and cons to each. I'm not a fan of Raffia in general, so that's just out for me. Um, I'm going to say the... One with the black treated leather. I like, I'm I'm one of those people that likes black leather with the monogram. I don't think I have anything like that, but I do like that look. It's also more low maintenance than having Vachetta. So I do like that. I know that it's going to be heavier and more structured and it has the card slots. I don't need the card slots here. I'm going to show you. This is just a Samorga insert that I have. This is the wipeable interior that I love so, so much because I use this for liquids, lotions, toiletries. And if I do use this as a clutch, it's usually by the beach or by the pool, very casual. So again, near lots of water and moisture and humidity. So I want it to be just really, really easy and carefree and low maintenance, which is what this is with just that one large piece of canvas running around and very little vachetta only on this tab. So I do, I really like this original version. Um, here, the reason why I say I don't need card slots, even if I were to use it as a proper clutch or bag, is because usually when you get an organizer insert like this from anywhere, Samorga, Zimoni, Amazon, wherever, this is not sponsored, um, I can put my card holder in one of these pockets. All of the organizer inserts have pockets. That's kind of the beauty. They organize your stuff. Here's my key pouch. So I feel like this is easier to use than, you know, those tight slits of card slots inside the new toiletries. Like if I were to have to shimmy them in like this one by one against the wall of the inside. Hmm. So I don't really need the card slots, but some of you may feel differently. Now, the new, new version with the Vachetta terrifies me because I don't need Vachetta when I'm going to be around liquids and water. I just don't. Even this Vachetta, I'm like, ugh, because you grab it with wet hands and then there's basically marks and fingerprints instantly. Now, I do spray all of my Vachetta with Apple Guard and that does help to patina the leather very evenly. I've gotten compliments even from, from my SA when she saw the handle on my pochette Matisse. She was like, how'd you do that? So I told her about Apple Guard and it does make it more water resistant, but something like this that's kind of like a throw around toiletry, I don't want to have to fuss with that Vachetta. Now, I'm going to say, you know, uh, before I showed an eye rolling meme, and I did have to pause and kind of like, uh, you know, grip my teeth a little bit because they added a ring here. Now, I know many of you who use this as a bag bag get these kinds of organizers that have a little cutout hole. And so then you can clip any kind of strap or chain on here, which makes it super versatile and super fun, right? But now Louis Vuitton has added on the newest version that's coming out this summer, a little ring on the larger one. So first of all, if you just wanna use it as a toiletry, it doesn't look as sleek anymore because now you've got the monogram, then you've got the vachetta, and you've got the hardware ring dangling. So I love simplicity. I think you guys know that if you're regulars here. So to me, it's just, added stuff, I guess, that I don't really need, nobody asked for. Maybe, actually, maybe, maybe, maybe Louis Vuitton took it as everyone asking for this because people were using this as a bag and they thought, oh, we're going to get um, praise for listening to our customers. You know, who knows? But uh, let me just show you, make believe that I had one of those inserts with the holes and this strap here, which I use with my, my push and accessoire, this one, I have it right here, I'll show you. This is really versatile. I'm gonna talk about that in a minute and compare it with the toiletry because I think it's just interesting price-wise. So this one is from Dress Up Your Purse. See, there's a watermark here already. This is Vachetta, Dress Up Your Purse. I have promo code down below in my description box at all times for Dress Up Your Purse. 
They are my favorite accessories shop. So imagine if you wanted to wear this really, really casual, kind of like a messenger style because it has that sort of silhouette, right, of a messenger bag. Again, imagine if the holes were there and you could wear it like this crossbody. I think it looks, you know, fun, easy, casual, like I said. So there's that. Then I have this one. Uh, this one is from Organize My Bag, another one of my favorite accessory shops. I think I still have promo code that is valid down in my description box. You might want to have a, a look. This is a uh, really nice adjustable Vachetta crossbody strap. They also have a version just like this on Dress Up Your Purse. Sometimes one or the other is sold out, so just check both. Sometimes I know many of you are disappointed because you go on to organize my bag and you're like, oh, it's not there anymore, or you go on to dress up your purse and you're like, oh, it's sold out. So just check both. I like both of their um, straps and accessories. They're really good quality, but again, here, let me just... So if you wanted a thinner look, here it is, more delicate, a vachetta, and it matches the vachetta here, right? So you could wear it like this as well. You could also shorten it. If you wanted to and just wear it on the shoulder, I'm just telling you, people got really creative and had fun with this piece and made it really versatile by dressing it up. And I don't know, I feel like Louis Vuitton just copied their customers. Here is one of my favorites, the oval chain. This one is from Dress Up Your Purse, but I have nearly an identical one from Organize My Bag. So again, just check both. But imagine... If this was on here, kind of delicate again, you could even double it up and have it dangling like this, right? You can really dress this up, it's so cute. So let me grab some others back there. This is a thicker, chunkier version. I actually got this from Next Fashion. It's a Canadian shop. So if you are based in Canada, it might be cheaper for you and especially shipping might be easier. But this too could work if you had, if you have the original Toiletry 26, and you want to get an insert and play around and use something like this, I think it's super fun. And you don't have to be committed to it because you can always take it off. If you're planning to get the new version with the ring attached and you don't want to just use that one chain that Louis Vuitton sends you, again, you can play around by adding different looks, right? And then this one's really fun. It's like pretty chunky. I've shown this before. Whew, this one is from Dress Up Your Purse. It might be sold out but you can check on their website. This is super fun. So if you wanted kind of like a Bottega look, Bottega vibe with the chunky chunky chain, look at that, right? It's really fun. And then you can use this as a shoulder strap as well. And there's a couple more back there. This one is a very interesting one. It's by color. So you can see the black and the gold mixed. This too is from Dress Up Your Purse. I don't know if it's still available or if it's sold out. A lot of their popular items sell out really fast, but they do replenish. And ta-da, that's kind of cool too, isn't it? And then this one was a gift from one of my followers, one of my subscribers, one of my followers on Instagram. I think she still is running her business. It was called Queen and Basic, I think. And this is a really pearly, fun one, kind of feminine. And that would go like this. It looks like it's smiling, right? So my point is, people were already having fun with this and making this super stylish and versatile and dressing it up and using it in different ways. So as much as I give Louis Vuitton kudos for watching and spying and then responding to what the customers have been doing, I also don't think many people have asked for this. Like, I think they would have preferred, maybe I'm biased, I would have preferred this and then the option to do whatever I want with it and play around with it versus it having Vachetta and a ring and a chain attached. And obviously, if you add all those things, it's going to drive up the price. And I really don't need all those bells and whistles. I would prefer the simplicity with a better price. And again, option to do what I want with it. So I just showed you this, the Pochette Accessoire. I'm curious what you guys think because this one here is now priced at $12.90. And the new new set with the two pouches are going to be priced at $17.90 or $17.60, right? So that's like a roughly, what? Um, only a $500 difference, a little less than $500 difference. So what do you guys think? If you were to compare like that, the most recent prices, do you think the new 
toiletry set at 1760 is a better deal than the pochette accessoire for 1290 or vice versa. I'm just curious because this too is super versatile. I mean, you can use this as a pouch, as a catch-all, and as a clutch under the arm. There's a photo, a famous photo of Sarah Jessica Parker way back in the day with this under her arm at a pretty nice event. And I just thought it looked really cute and surprisingly kind of chic, even though this is a canvas piece and very casual. So I use almost all of these on my pochette, okay? So even this, like you could technically use it on here. Um, all of these, so, oh, this I use a lot when I'm traveling, it's very easy. So, and this one, like I said, one of my favorites. I've shown this before, but I like to sometimes, I mean, I wear it crossbody mostly, so I keep it long, but sometimes I like to double it up and play with it and dress it up. So I know I'm sort of all over the place right now showing you these chains, these accessories, but I'm trying to make a point, which is sometimes you just have to leave the styling part to the customers, you know, to have fun. And they could have, Louis Vuitton, I mean, they could have come out with a version with a ring attached or a chain attached or even a kit to purchase, right? without necessarily discontinuing the original version. Like, I don't think there were that many people who were excited and happy when they discontinued this altogether. It was sort of like, oh, what are they going to bring out next and how much is it going to be, right? We were kind of anticipating a big price increase and then they were going to do something but nothing really sensational. And again, I don't think they've done anything groundbreaking. So I'm not, again, I don't want to be critical. <laughs> I just, I'm just stating my case. Um, Anyway, so I'm just curious, which do you think is the better deal now? The toiletry set or the pochette accessoire or accessoire, however you pronounce it? Um, just curious. I am going to do a video soon comparing this with the Chanel wallet on chain because I've gotten a few requests as this is considered somewhat an entry level piece to Louis Vuitton, although not really because it's now over a thousand dollars. And then for Chanel also, the wallet on chain sort of the entry level piece um, although now there are smaller mini bags that are cheaper than the walk but I'll compare those two in an upcoming video if you are interested stay tuned for that but let me know your thoughts and yeah I just I'm really curious I would love to know your thoughts uh, my thoughts don't really matter at this point because I already have one and so I'm not buying any of the new ones but for those of you who are interested and on the market and sort of comparing the new versions I want to know which one you are gravitating towards all right I will see you all next time thanks so much Bye bye